and this poem is called If Life Were a Movie. If Life Were a Movie, I wouldn't get stuck behind an 80 year old grandma in the Buick. When I'm already 20 minutes late to school. I dress like I took an outfit from Hannah Montana's revolving closet every morning. My fairy godmother would have probably shown up in a magical pumpkin or something by now. But, but life's not a movie. If my life were a movie, I would have both of my parents under the same roof instead of one here and one across the country. I wouldn't have to be scared of men because I wouldn't have only had a mother figure. I would never have to doubt that, that someone out there loved me. I wouldn't have to feel disposable. Like I was easily controllable. And that I wasn't lovable. Broken family wouldn't have to mean broken, broken child. child. After all, how can you expect a tree to grow without, without any roots? I wouldn't have to decide if abandon was a feeling or a description of who I am. If this were a movie, my, my house, house would, would feel like, like my home. home. If life were a movie, I would have already reached ultimate success. I'd have a report card so, so impressive. It'd be documented in the Library of Congress. I could speak Spanish fluently without having to try. And French. And German. I'd have a 36 on the ACT. Without having to go through endless nights of studying. I would have been that 11-year-old. Who's already graduated from Harvard. Or Stanford. Or Yale. Or one of those national spelling bee champions. Who can spell iridocyclitis? I-R-O-D-C. Cut. Cut. Take two. I-R-O-D-O-C-Y-C-L-I-T-I-S. Without looking twice. I'd be the star of the musical. I'd be the cheer captain. I'd be student council president. Simultaneously. All of my teachers would adore me. I'd be able to stay out of all the pointless drama. And, and just be friends, friends with everyone. everyone. I'd, I'd be, be someone people, people could look, look up to. to. I would be the goal. If life were a movie, I would have love figured out. There'd be no confusion. No, no back and forth. The boy would always know the right thing to say at, at the, the right, right time. time. It would be perfectly acceptable for me to marry a woman and have children like any other family. Families like the one I want to have would, would have, have more representation than one show that ran for six seasons. Not having a boyfriend would be just as acceptable as having one. I would be able to be independent. I would have enough love inside myself before, before ever, ever choosing to be with, with anyone else. I would be bold and bright and beautiful so that when someone would ask me who my first love was, I would, I would have, have enough courage to, to say myself. myself. The frustration. The anger. The expectations. They become too much. They overwhelm my mind. Then I have to wonder, am I the problem? Is there something wrong with me? Why, Why is, is everyone, everyone else, else always living my movie? Life's not a movie. There's no script. No play-by-play. -play. No, no rehearsal until, until every scene turns out perfect. Exactly the way I want it to. I wish everything worked out as well as it does in my head. Maybe one day it will. Someday. Soon. Soon.